Let's go straight to Joel Dry now, who's with the Premier in Toowoomba. Joel, she's had a tough day. Yeah, Andrew, the Premier is working really hard to get some clear air so she can push her policies to the voters, but this issue of Adani continues to plague her. She was very generous with her time today, holding an extended press conference, willing to answer any questions that people had about Adani, and there are still plenty of them. A morning river walk and a chance meeting with supporters. Oh, how are you? Perhaps more logistics than luck, with the well wishes seemingly planted by Labor minders. I have no idea about that. Joining local members in Mackay, the oh. Premier announced a new Bruce Highway Trust to future-proof the state's lifeblood. We've got a collegiate approach to where the money goes on the Bruce Highway in a 15-year action plan. But it's Adani still clouding her campaign. It's great to be here in Mackay. Labor's regional MPs want it. I will always support Adani for jobs. Put your bloody money on the table, guys. Let's get on with it. The Premier staying firm. Her funding veto and partners' links to the project shouldn't stop the mine happening. Adani themselves have said, we do not need taxpayers' money to build this mine. For 45 minutes, the Premier fielded question after question on the saga. Done, dusted, excellent. In the hope of burying the issue. At least everyone's in a happy mood today. A mood that maybe won't last, with news the Premier's personal pick to run for the seat of Rockhampton, Margaret Strelo, will now run as an independent after losing a factional fight. I haven't heard that. I'd, I'd find that surprising. Anastasia Palaszczuk could do without any more campaign surprises as she returns here to the southeast, to Woomba, a traditional LMP stronghold. The LMP, meantime, are focused on law and order, promising to create a new crime of domestic violence and the rights for women and families to know if a man has a history of DV. This as the unions continue to make sure Tim Nichols is haunted by his past. I think it's already pretty grim under Labor and unions here in Queensland. In Toowoomba, Joel Dry, Nine News.